To another Stanley Parable episode. So this time we are gonna see how this story turns out. Now let's just get started, shall we? All right. I'm just gonna skip the intro. If you want to see the intro, just go watch the first. What the fuck? What the what the what the fuck? <laughs> What's up with the textures? <laughs> okay. Stanley decided to what the crap? The staff lounge. What the fuck? What, what the What the Okay, let's sort of like do that again because uh, much better. What the fuck was that? I mean, what, what the what the Stanley fuck? Decided to go to the staff but, lounge well, to check let's on just go and he never functioned well by take another path this time. Yeah, we've heard all this before. Blah, 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 blah. All right, Stanley first dilemma. He entered the door on his left. No, he didn't. He entered the door on his right, not bitch. The way to the employee lounge. Yeah, I know. And Stanley knew it perfectly well. Mm, no. So he turned left at the first open door uh, just kidding. and walked back in the right direction. Stanley was so bad. <laughs> I fucking love this part. It's incredible he wasn't five years ago. Um, Maybe this whatever. is why everyone had left. No one wanted to be around someone as bad at listening as him. <laughs> Since he was walking into the middle of nowhere and thus ruining the entire story, Stanley decided that he would punish himself. Punish? So when he came to the elevator like how? and the doors opened, he stepped inside and pushed the button to go up. Yeah, man. How about, um... No! Let's go down, bridge! Oh, Stanley. <sighs> <laughs> you know... You really aren't going anywhere, and I don't say that deceitfully. I truthfully mean that there isn't a story down here. The story was back up where I told you to go in the first place. Right mm -hmm. now, you're just running around looking at empty halls. <laughs> and frankly, that's perhaps even more infuriating for me. <laughs> so why don't you throw me a bone, give me a chance, and just let me tell the story I want to tell, hmm? All right, old man. I'll let you tell your freaking story. Whatever! Yeah. Yeah. Oh shoot. Now listen carefully. This is important. Stanley walked I'm listening. through the red door. Uh, <laughs> let's go on the red board. Just do that. Oh man. Fuck. <laughs> Mother Let's do it. Good. Good. Mm. Now, if you don't mind, there's something I'd like to show you. But to do that, I think it would be best for us to start from the beginning. Okay. What? I'm going to start all over? What the fuck? This is a very sad story about the death of... <laughs> <Stanley>. <laughs> oh, shit. Stanley worked for a company in a big building where he was employee number 427. Uh-huh. His job pushing buttons demanded little of him, so there was not much of himself to give. And in this way, Stanley's job felt less and less like his every day. Mm -hmm. But if buttons need pushing one day, it means they'll need pushing the next, and then the next. B, why? So what does it say? question or judgment, Stanley continued to do what the screen told him. P? One keystroke flowed into Five. another keystroke, flowed into his ride home, flowed into dinner, flowed into waking up, flowed into Five. going to Okay, this doesn't say anything. Was again. Stanley was typing out a complete sentence that said absolutely nothing at all. <laughs> if in reality no one ever actually disappeared from the office and Stanley never got the opportunity to make a decision to choose which path he wanted to take, would his <laughs> life still dinner? have any meaning? No. Perhaps when we long for something deeply enough, these hopes and fantasies become so strong in our minds that we truly believe that we're there, controlling that person, and living that adventure. To yeah. manipulate your own thoughts and emotions might mean freedom from a self-imposed prison. But these delusions can be fatal to those who can't tell the difference. And so, okay. Stanley, if that door never opened, if I'll never be able to walk away from those people and from these buttons, is this oh my God. still Stop. my experience? What the fuck, dude? Am I actually happy? Yeah. 
Ask you're happy like shit. By pushing a button. Please then die. He pushed a button, um and then he pushed a button. Please then die. he pushed a button. Then he pushed a button. Uh-huh. Alright, man, I get ya. What the mother what the what the What? <sighs> Fuckity fucking fuck that was okay. That that was the ending. That alright. Next time I'm gonna take some other path. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. A little shorter than the others, but thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Please subscribe. <sighs>